That sort of sounds like James when we've run out of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> complaining that there's no coffee in camp. But so yeah, so Heather, I think that that has to be one of the most bizarre sounds that comes out of a bird's mouth out here, is a bird that sounds like babies crying, really. So the trumpeter hornbill, uh, and speaking of hornbills, we've got its cousin, which I shall show you in a moment. I'm now also scared of the comment that I've just made about James. I feel like there's going to be much reprimanding going on. <laughs> but have a quick look. Not a trumpeter hornbill, but there is indeed a yellow-billed hornbill. Can you see it? Quickly, you'll see the big fig trees and things growing around in the, the river systems. What are you doing? Why is your mouth open? Look like it's ready to have an argument, don't you think? They always look so grumpy. We're going to keep scanning the plains, though. We'll try and hopefully chase an animal out that is sleeping in the grass. Of course, we're not going to do that, but it would be nice. So James has got signal again. We're playing a game of battling uh, the gremlins. But let's go across to him, and I hope he's not cross with me because I told him that's what he sounds like. I'm so angry I could spit. We too have not found any animals, I'm afraid.